So I just want to like talk about why I love the game Blaze Blue so much. Um, I've talked I've talked about it a little bit on like my tier list video for like fighting games, and I basically put all of them really high up, especially Chrono Phantasma and Central Fiction. But basically, to me, Blaze Blue is perfect. It just is. It's so perfect. The only thing that holds it back is I own it on PlayStation and it doesn't have the best net code on PlayStation and that's the only flaw with the game but other than that I love Blaze Blue I love the music oh my god I cannot believe how good the music is in Blaze Blue it is so good I just I could put my headphones on and just play the game and I'm just listening to a fucking orchestra just go all out they are fucking shooting out into our outer space and they're just amazing. They're, they're just so good. I fucking adore Blaze Blue. I'm trying not to cuss as much, but I can't I can't help it when I'm talking about something I love, something I'm passionate about. I, Blaze Blue is so good. The characters are so, like, diverse and unique. Ragna is such a cool-looking character. He's so badass. He's got a red eye. He's got a red eye and a green eye. His weapon turns into a scythe. It's so cool, and he's so fun to play as. Kag Kagura is so fun. Tager is such a cool character. Arachne is such a unique fucking spider piece of goo that shoots shit all over the place. It's awesome. You know, there, there's so much uniqueness. Terami is a psychopathic joker badass who could beat your ass. He's so awesome. I, I love the roster of the game. And it's just so fun to play. At the end of the day, it, it's so fun to play. It's so combo heavy. And I like combo heavy games. I also like neutral heavy games. But the game has a fantastic neutral. Being able to air dash, double jump. There's like three different types of techs. Uh, you could air grab. You could. Every character feels completely different from one another. It is so fun and there's such a high skill ceiling especially with characters like Izanagi who's so fucking hard to use I love Blaze Blue it's so it's such a masterpiece and there's something about there's something about it that clicks with me and I don't really know what it is there's something about Blaze Blue that other 2D fighters don't quite do it for me Guilty Gear doesn't do it for me the same way Undernight doesn't do it for me the same way. Even Grand Blue. I fucking love Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising. I love that game. I put over 100 hours in that game. But in comparison to Blaze Blue, it really doesn't even touch it. I love the fact that there's a combo breaker. But if you there's a decision making in that where if you don't use it, you could you know, go into uh, Overdrive and you're, you're stronger from that if you don't use your combo breaker. Um, you, you know, you know what I'm talking about if you played the game. It's so, it's such a fantastic fighting game, and I can't rave about it enough. I love it. And I guess I just wanted to rant about it because I feel like the game does, I feel like the game doesn't really get the love it deserves. Um, it's, it's such a, it's a game that has a really niche audience compared to other fighting games like Mortal Kombat, you know, and it's like, I love Mortal Kombat, I, I am really nostalgic for it, my first fighting game ever, or one of, one of my first video games in general was a Mortal Kombat game, so when it comes to being a fanboy, I'm up there with Mortal Kombat, but when, it, when you really compare the quality of the games, Mortal Kombat doesn't fucking touch Blaze Blue, it's not even in the same stratosphere, Blaze Blue is such a expertly made game and I can't rave about it enough I just can't you know go listen to blaze blue music I could do it in the car I could I could drive somewhere and I'm just listening to the OST for it and I and I'm listening to every little instrument and I'm like bro why is this so why does this go so hard more than like any other video game music almost I think the only like I think the only game music that really competes for me is maybe um 
games like Zelda. I love Zelda. Zelda is my favorite video game franchise in general, right? Like I'm, I'm a huge Zelda fan and I love the music there, but Blaze Blue to me competes with it. They're very different, but the fact that it's even in that quality is insane considering how huge Zelda is and how niche Blaze Blue is. Or even a game series like, um, uh, what was it? What was I thinking of? Oh, Xenoblade Chronicles. You know, like, just some amazing music. And Blaze Blue just keeps up with it. And damn near exceeds it in some ways. It, it's, it goes so hard. And when you're sitting there and you're playing the game and you're making all these decisions and you're, you're going fast. And then in the background you have this badass music just blaring in the background that's just it, it's it's you're in awe it's like i'm playing an actual anime battle that's what it feels like sometimes it feels like i'm in an actual anime fight and you know i'm just i just gotta outsmart you and outplay you and beat your ass you know and the game is so flashy and so fun you know damn near whoever you play as it's fun and you could switch you could switch from one character to another and they're so different. And I know this video is kinda all over the place, but I just want to get out there. If you if you love fighting games, if you love if you love 2D fighters, if you've ever played Guilty Gear and you went, hey, this is really fun, I want another game like this, go play Blaze Blue. It's not exactly the same. Blaze Blue, I would say it's a little bit more combo heavy. But um I think a lot of casual players like that anyway, you know, like having to be able to do combos. So, uh, please go play Blaze Blue. It is a masterpiece, truly a masterpiece of a fighting game. So uh, yeah, if you, if you like this video, you can like it. And if you dislike this video, that's okay. As long as you go pick up Blaze Blue and, uh, have a good day. もっと Rebel 2 Action! <laughs> 